downtown Bangkok has been turned into a battlefield. Thai troops have been firing bullets at anti-government protesters in a push to end a two-month political standoff. Protesters, though, aren't fleeing without a fight and have been firing makeshift rockets themselves. They also burned a police bus and even taunted armed soldiers. As night fell, plumes of smoke hung over the city and the sound of gunfire and grenades could be heard. The fight is over who should lead the country and it threatens to destroy what has been one of Southeast Asia's most stable democracies. The protests are led by a group called the Red Shirts, and they claim the current coalition government came to power illegitimately. They had been in talks with the government about new elections. However, this violence is threatening any progress that has been made on that front. At least 34 people have been killed in the weeks of violence. Five people have been killed and scores more injured in this latest skirmish. This fighting has forced officials to close off parts of the city. Stores downtown have also shuttered, and the U.S. Embassy, along with others, have also shut down. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.